Bill, we're quickly approaching our first of several big ticket opportunities for the city to bring in revenue and tourism. Let's send it to Mitch Carter, who is downtown for us today with a preview. Here in Evansville, the Ford Center is used to seeing all variety of events from basketball to hockey to even concerts. But this February, the big thing coming to town is wrestling. Three. For the first time in tournament history, the Indiana High School Athletic Association's Boys State Wrestling Finals are going to be held in Evansville. Big news for executive director of the Ford Center and Victory Theater, Scott Shonicky. You, know, you want their first experience when they get to Evansville to be like, wow, that was a great, you know, hey, it flowed right. You know, because a lot of them, you know, when you replace something that they've been going up to Indy for so long, they kind of know where they park, they know where everything's at. Coming here, it's their first time experience. So, According to the IHSAA, it's the first time Evansville has hosted a state finals event in any sport, but why Evansville? Well, Gamebridge Fieldhouse up in Indy, which has hosted the state finals every year since 2000, will be home to the 2024 NBA All-Star Game on the same weekend. Thus, the top wrestlers across the state will bring their talents down south. It's going to be a serious undertaking, but mm -hmm. Shawnee says they're excited. It's not the arena side, actually. I'm very comfortable. We, that will be the easy part. Mm -hmm. It's actually going to be the fan experience part that, the, you know, and as a community, there's, you know, we're meeting every a couple weeks with uh, other parts of the downtown district and the visit Evansville mm -hmm. to try to figure out how that part, because that's going to be the real key to it. For our local state wrestling hopefuls, the tournament being in town presents a unique home mat, if you will, advantage for the first time. In modern day's wrestling room, the Wildcats are gearing up. We're definitely not going to complain that we don't have to spend three hours in a car. Um, you know, so when we, when we heard it, we thought that would be pretty cool. To Indianapolis, usually people have to travel far, and my grandparents and all of them would not more than likely go up, but now since it's in Evansville, I could have everyone I know sitting there watching me. So while a lot of wrestling happens between sectionals this weekend and states in mid-February, there's a little more on the line in the southern part of the state this year. It, it's a unique opportunity, uh, so when you get it, you got to grab it and you know, kind of shine, and I think people will be that haven't been here in a long time will be uh, impressed with the area. Well, they tell me they've been getting requests for this ever since the event was dropped, so they wanted me to let you know Tickets for the IHSAA State Wrestling Finals go on sale on February 14th. Reporting at Evansville, Mitch Carter, 14 News.